Class is slowly reintroducing kids back into the classroom. Tomorrow, preschoolers are next up to return. Lana Harris joins us with more on the precautions in place and what parents can expect. You know, it's like the first day of school, but for real this time. Preschoolers are finally going to get to experience a real school day, and CMS believes they can get them back into the classroom safely. Safe to say for some parents, teaching children at home has been tough. And nothing's getting done. It's not productive. They are not learning anything. But the wait to get back into the classroom is over for CMS preschoolers, who were the latest wave of students allowed back in the building, following the 1,200 students with special needs who went back to school at the end of September. To keep them safe, CMS spent over $257,000 on PPE over the summer, including face shields, masks, antimicrobial floor finish, gowns, and thermometers. They've also created a CMS readiness dashboard that tracks the students and staff who've tested positive for the coronavirus, PPE levels, staffing levels, and potential COVID clusters to use as a guide to determine if it's necessary to go back to remote learning. I think anything that we can do to help to slow the spread is important. Now, kindergarten and elementary schoolers will go back to class on November 2nd, middle schoolers on November 23rd, and high schoolers right before Christmas on December 14th. In Charlotte, I'm Lana Harris, WCNC Charlotte.